The sex industry in Kenya presents many faces. Pornography has found its home right here in Nairobi. It's a $13 billion industry in the United States of America and for producers in the country, that's their inspiration to make millions. Acting in the porn industry is becoming attractive to many young men and women and is becoming very popular. Performing, producing and trafficking pornographic films is illegal in Kenya and is punishable by a jail sentence of up to two years. I'm going behind the supply and demand chain in the pornography industry in Nairobi, where we have been granted a rare interview in the history of national television and when things get heated up, we are treated to an exclusive viewing as a parting shot. Access to pornography is not limited to the many Kenyan websites or even social media that the government can seem to control. As a matter of fact, you don't have to go out looking for pornography. Pornography will look for you. No, no, I'm just driving off. It's okay. Which others do you have? Do you have the ones for the... Sorry? Porn. You have porn? Yeah. Where? In the new office. Have the original what's, the, what's the difference? These are originals. Yeah. The other one is the uh, Okay, so these are foreign. You have local ones? Huh? You have local ones? Which which type? Which ones? These are Kenyans. From which part of Kenya? These are Kenyans. This is Kamba. Uh, this one Coast Girls. Uh -huh. This one Kikuyu. Wow. And this one Kamba. Kamba. Uh, How much is one? An another Kamba. Five hundred each. Five hundred. Yeah, those are local, my friend. My investigation into the porn industry in Kenya starts right here. A tall building next to Jamia shopping mall. I'm ushered into a dimly lit room where I've been assured of privacy by a 23-year-old girl who tells me for 2,000 shillings I can watch real-life porn with any of the girls performing unimaginable acts. She's in charge here. The catch is one girl for 2,000 shillings, but since most pornographic acts are performed by two or more people, Two girls will cost me 4,000 Ken shillings. I choose one girl. Um, and it's Anita. Anita. She appears easy to talk to. Immediately, Anita leads me to a free hedonistic feast for the eyes before I even begin to ask questions. I beg for a sit-down for a casual conversation and she tells me the floor houses at least seven girls, each with her own room. Anita is 24 years old and to feed her two-year-old daughter, she is forced to come here every day. She pays a pimp 30,000 shillings per month and she is sometimes forced to sleep with at least 20 men per month to raise enough money and still make profit. Performing in porn movies is part of the game to lure men into sleeping with her to make more money. After the porn show, you can get the sex for an extra 1,500 shillings. A few meters from the noisy street, I enter a club most popular for its showtime acts of strippers. I pay 1,000 shillings for the VIP lounge where an overpowering aroma of lust fills the air as men sip their drinks, hypnotized by the lewdness of the acts on the table. Girls here perform stripping acts that leave nothing to imagination as they smear each other with yogurt with dildos firmly fixed on the tables. One girl was smoking a cigarette with her privates. A pornographic film is playing out on the big TV screens as the naked girls get on top of each other using dildos to pump up the appetite from the men glued to gyrating flesh. It's just 4,000 shillings for a private session upstairs. Part of the money stays with the club, the rest goes to the strippers who make at least 25,000 shillings or more per month.
producers of local pornographic films are making a kill out of this business. Now we've been granted a rare interview to speak to two lesbian pornographic actors in this industry. We meet an influential pornographic director in downtown Nairobi who refuses an interview but leads us to a hotel where he's just about to shoot his new hit local porn film. After paying the hotel owner 2,000 shillings for the day, whatever happens behind closed doors is none of his business. Two lesbian porn actors lying lazily on the bed prepare for the film, but first grant us an interview. How old are you? 20. When did you start doing lesbian porn? 2010. How many uh, girls have you slept with? Around 40. 40 girls? You met one guy? One ten. What is it? Ten. One guy. Around because of time, the porn director stopped our interview because of his tight schedule with many acts to shoot. The girls performed right in front of our cameras a sneak preview of the next local porno film that will be out by the time of airing this feature. Tomorrow on Sex in the City. You are there for money.